Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will see how to fix MSI monitor flickering line issue. So without wasting your time, let's get started. So the step one is check cable connection. Let's make sure that the all cables connections are secure. So if you are using HDMI display port type C or any other, so ensure that these cables are firmly connected to the both the monitor and your device like PC, laptop or gaming console. A loose connection can cause flickering line issue. So if possible, use a different cables to rule out any cable related issue. Step 2 is change refresh rate. Sometimes the monitor refresh rate can cause flickering line issue. So you can simply change the refresh rate from the actual refresh rate to any higher or lower version. Okay. To do you can simply open the display settings. And here you can simply go to advanced settings and here you will see a refresh rate. Here you can simply select the refresh rate. Okay. So in my case these are a 40 or a 60 refresh rate available. Then you can simply select a refresh rate. Another refresh rate. Okay. Step 3 is update driver. So outdated or corrupt graphics drivers can lead to a display issue. So you can visit the graphics card manufacturer website or download the latest driver for your specific model and install them and restart your computer. Step 4. Disable G-Sync or FreeSync. If your monitor has a variable refresh rate technologies like G-Sync or FreeSync, enable trying disabling them. So access your graphics card settings and then turn off G-Sync or FreeSync. This can sometimes resolve flickering problem. Step 5. Reset the monitor settings. So resetting your monitor is factory default settings. It can help sometime issue. To reset you can simply open the monitor setting by simply pressing the M button. And then use the navigation keys and then go to setting. And here go to the reset button to reset its settings and then press enter. And then it will reset the monitor setting. So if none of the above steps work it may be time to contact the customer support or further assistant. You can simply contact them and after that they can simply provide you steps that can help you to resolve the issue. Or if any a internal issue in this case they can home visit to your home and then replace your monitor. So if you found this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorial. Goodbye.